So you've gone out and captured some amazing photospheres, but when you try to upload them to Google Maps, you're most likely not going to be successful. Uploading photospheres to Google Maps seems like a mystery nowadays, but there's actually a super simple workaround which will allow you to do just that. Google discontinued their Street View app in 2023, which was the only way to upload them to specific coordinates and have it show as a blue dot on the map. But in this video, I'll be showing you how you can do just that. So without further ado, let's jump right in. So first, what you need to do is go over to our web browser and type in maps.moomoo.me, which is the website we'll be using for today's video. You can do this on any device, you just need a suitable web browser, and I'll leave a link to the website in the description of this video. Once you get in, you'll need to sign in with your Google account, but don't worry, this is completely safe because the site will only manage your photos and it won't even store your email address. Once you're signed in, you will come to an upload page. Press on Add Image and select the photosphere you want to upload to Google Maps. If you took the photosphere with a DJI drone, it should already have the location stored in the photo, but if your sphere doesn't contain the location in its metadata, then you can pinpoint the exact location where it was taken on the map below. Once you've uploaded the image and got the coordinates, you can then hit Upload. You'll then be taken to a screen which says your photosphere has been published and it will create a link to your photosphere. If you click the link, it will say no user photo available. You just need to wait a few hours for the photosphere to appear on Google Maps via the link and up to three days for the blue dot to appear on the map itself. So it's been three days now and if I zoom into the location of the photosphere, you can see that it's now visible as a blue dot in Google Maps and if I click on it, the photosphere shows up successfully. So there we have it. That's how you can upload photospheres to Google Maps really easily. If you have any questions, you can let me know in the comments. And if this video was helpful, then please let me know by clicking the like button. And if you like all things drones, then I recommend you check out my channel, where I have more videos about how to get more out of your drone flights. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.